guys, we're gonna join any server that we want in three, two, one. Oh my goodness, guys, it actually worked. Watch the video to the very end to find out how I actually did this. Hello YouTube, welcome back to the video, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to join any server on the Minecraft Xbox One Edition. I am super excited guys, because as you guys know, we have been stuck with 6 servers for the longest of times. These servers are actually pretty boring, and I say 6 servers because we just got the new edition of Galactite, and it's just the beta, so it's not really having too many features. But today I'm going to be showing you guys how to join any server that you guys want, such as Factions, Prisons, Skyblock, and even UHC, which is the server that I am on right now. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. Okay, guys, we are on the bridge right now. This is actually insane. Okay, so it's this fight. Okay, so these guys are not ready. These guys are not ready. Look at them. Look at them. Okay, guys. Oh, my goodness. We got a super secret technique. We're going to keep building over. Okay, I believe we're going to be able to go ahead and score these people. Oh, watch this technique, guys. They are not ready. They are just not ready. We got a full bridge going over. Oh, what they try? What they try to do? Hold on, hold on. Okay, we're gonna go at it. Yo, why is this guy? Look at him. What is this guy doing? He has clearly not learned the technique. He, oh, hold on. Someone stop that guy. Someone stop him. Hold on. Okay, okay, hold on. This guy. Someone stop that guy. Wait. Is our team gonna do anything? Oh, get out of here. Let's go. Wait, what? No way. No way. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Someone get this guy out of here. It's 3v1. What's up? Okay, guys. So we got our secret bridge over here. We're just gonna go ahead and sprint over here. Oh, what they try to do? Oh, we got him. Look at him. Look at him. Oh. <laughs> Yo, I was about to score. No. <laughs> what? At least our team is winning. Oh my goodness, guys. You see how unprotected they are? No way. Okay, we're just gonna go ahead and sprint forward. This is why build, 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 build. Oh, oh, he ain't ready. He is not ready. Oh, <laughs> yo, wait, 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 wait. Watch this. We're gonna score. Wait, ah, oh, they're build. They're they're protecting their stuff. Wait, I can just drop down. <laughs> yo, we win. So for this video, all you really need is Minecraft. It's that simple, guys. Go all the way to where your character is, your profile, and then go down to settings. Once you guys are on settings, you want to go to general and then network settings. Once you're in network settings, go to advanced settings, and then you want to go to DNS settings just like this. You want to go ahead and switch it from automatic to manual just like I have here, and then type in these numbers. So for primary IPv4 DNS settings, you want to go ahead and type in these numbers. Each box is going to have three numbers. So 104, 238, 130 and last but not least 180 once you guys have that done then you want to go ahead and press enter and then you want to go ahead and put an eight in every single box for all four of them then you guys are all good to go click on join server and you're going to be loaded with a brand new menu so when you guys hop on any server, you guys will be greeted with this menu. It doesn't matter which one you join. You'll be greeted with the same menu as long as your DNS settings are set to the ones that I told you. As you guys can see here, we have connect to a server and you can also remove a server, which is actually pretty cool. So when you go ahead and connect to a server, you're able to go ahead and put in the server IP. And then most of the time, the server port is actually going to be 19132, just like you see here with Hyperlands and the MC Bedrock UHC server. So you have the ability to go ahead and connect to it one time or you can either join a server as you can see i kind of messed up here it will glitch out so let's go ahead and reload so for today's tutorial we're going to be joining broken lens this is actually a pretty cool server that's extremely big and should be a featured server but i'm just not sure why it isn't yet but let's go ahead and type in the server ip as you can see, I have my server of choice, so let's go ahead and add it to the server list as well. I find that to be very important and it saves a lot of time. When you guys are done, click on the submit button and you'll be all good to go. This will automatically connect you to the server and you guys will be on the server in no time. It takes a little bit for it to go ahead and connect, so just wait a little bit. It should take about 30 seconds, but once you guys are on the server, you're on it for good. And then you're able to have it on your list to go ahead and rejoin whenever you guys want to. As you guys can see, we're on Broken Lens and it just loaded in. The spawn is actually a little bit laggy, so keep that in mind. This server is not completely laggy on its games, but it is a pretty big one. This is why the MCUHC server is actually a really good substitute for this one, because it's actually able to go ahead and load in a lot more, and it only has 100 players. But this one actually has 3,000 people playing right now, which is actually pretty insane. But let's go ahead and check out the mini games that they have. 
So to select your mini games, go ahead and click on this orange die, and you'll see a bunch of them. And these images will load, it just takes a while. So we got Sky Wars, we got Dungeons, we just got a bunch of different things on here. I definitely recommend checking it out. But today we're going to be doing Sky Wars, and you can actually see the player count, which is actually insane. Over 300 people playing, let's go ahead and connect, and all we need to go ahead and do is just wait for the Sky Wars game to start. There's a bunch of them going on at every single moment. The reason why I'm not the biggest fan of this server is Sky Wars does take a little bit for it to go ahead and load in, versus Hyperlands where it's able to go ahead and just load you into a Sky Wars match as soon as you die. But let's go ahead and hop onto this gameplay. If you guys are wanting to go ahead and start your Sky Wars game, go ahead and go up to this NPC right here, which is going to be the Quick Play NPC. As you can see, this will automatically launch you into a game, and you'll be able to go ahead and play Sky Wars in no time. As you can see, we have 12 out of 12 people, so we're able to go ahead and start this game. So I'm super excited. I don't know if I can win. I know Hyperlands was actually pretty difficult to go ahead and win on, but we may be able to go ahead and win. But look at this, guys. This is actually extremely cool. So let's go ahead and open our chest. So you automatically get started with a lot of things. So let's go ahead and try to win. So I'm going to go for the rushing technique. We're going to see if we can... Hold on! That guy's rushing! Yo! What? No way! No way! The lag! Oh my goodness! Wait! 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 Are we... Are, hold on! Wait! Yo! Yo! Hold, hold on! Wait! We might actually win this! We might actually win this! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh, what? No way! No way, guys! You saw that? No way! That guy was definitely on MCPE. No way, guys! How? Yo, there's no way we just pulled that off, guys. So that guy was obviously a rusher, so let's go ahead and try not to have that happen to us. So as you can see, we're going to do some quick builds real quick. I really don't like this FOV. This FOV scares me to death, guys. Just look at this. Like, this is so broken how far we are. But let's go ahead and actually jump over to this island. It may have some pretty good stuff for us. I'm not 100%. Oh, it's got some armor. Okay, so we're going to definitely win this. I don't know. We might win, but that was crazy, guys. I can't believe Okay, so let's go ahead and build over to the next island. We're just going to keep going. Or actually, oh, there's another chest. Okay, so let's try to get this one. We got a chest plate. So we're getting a good start. Oh my goodness. Okay, we need to get some food. Okay, so as you can see, it is a little bit glitchy on this server. So I'm really curious if we can actually win. I don't want to eat this raw chicken because I know that's going to be going downhill for us. So let's go ahead and eat this melon real quick. I'm really trying to stay alive here. This might be hardcore because it seems like we can't even eat foods. I don't know what's going on, guys. So let's go ahead and quickly build over here. Oh, oh, oh. Yo, 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 please help. Oh, oh, oh. oh no, no. Okay, I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it, guys. Speed. We're, we're becoming a rusher. Hold on. Watch this, guys. Watch this technique. Watch this technique. Hold on. He's on MCPE. Watch him. Watch him. Watch him. Watch him. MCPE. MCPE. Oh my goodness. MCPE. 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 Oh my goodness. MCPE. MCPE. Wait, what? No. The lag on this server is crazy. The lag on this server is crazy. Oh my. Wait, what? Yo. Yo. No way. Did we just get him? Yo, that is crazy, guys. Okay. So yeah, that guy's definitely an MCP. But let's go ahead and apparently, yeah, the lag on this server is pretty bad, guys. So let's go ahead and try a different one. In my opinion, this server is okay, but it is pretty laggy from time to time, creating a pretty bad playing experience. So let's go ahead and build over. Oh my goodness, how many people can we get like this? There's no way we're going to be able to pull this off again. Oh, another guy? Another guy. Hold on, hold on. Oh, hold on. Another guy. Another guy. Wait. Yes, 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 yes. Yo, oh, oh yo, yo, no. What? The lag. The lag. Guys, I would have been able to knock him off, but it's so laggy. This is like the weirdest game ever. I don't even know what to do. Okay, let's try a different server. Okay, so this server, pretty laggy, and it definitely needs some work. But let's go ahead and try the UHC server. They also have Sky Wars, so let's go ahead and see if we can get a better playing experience. So currently, we are on Bedrock Play, one of my favorite servers. But let's go ahead and get started here. So this is actually pretty cool. So let's go ahead and hop on their Sky Wars. Let's go ahead and wrap the video up with this. I'm hoping that we can get a good playing experience. It may be possible. Who knows? So I'll see you guys once we get started.
Okay, guys, so we are actually on this map. So this is exact. Wait a minute. This is exactly like Hypixel. What the? I know you guys are seeing this, guys. This is insane. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys one more method on how to get servers. It's actually pretty easy, but you're going to need an Android phone. The first method I really wanted to go ahead and showcase because it was actually just with your Xbox, but now you're going to need an Android phone specifically. So let's go ahead and head over to the App Store. So when you get to the App Store, you want to go ahead and type in MC LAN. This is going to go ahead and bring you to a very cool app there's one paid version and then there's one non-paid version this is why i'm definitely recommending the direct xbox method but as you guys can see here mcun proxy server right here this one i believe is the full version yep it is and as you guys can see here it has been updated last in july 18 2020 still being updated fixed a bunch of crashes which is actually pretty cool and then as you guys can see here here is the trial, so people actually go ahead and download this as well, but you only get the servers for 10 minutes, which is actually rather unfortunate. This is why I'm definitely recommending the Xbox way. So I'm going to go ahead and hop on the paid version because it's actually decent. So let's go ahead and try hyperlands.net. We're going to go ahead and click on start, and as you guys can see, the server is running now. Let's go ahead and head over to our Xbox, and you guys will see. So when you guys get on your Xbox, click on play, then go to friends, and then scroll all the way down. You're going to see under land games, play.hyperlands, you're going to see all of this. It's actually pretty cool. Then go ahead and connect. As you can see, it said unable to connect to the server. So let's go ahead and try again. So scroll all the way down and then click on join, and we should be able to go ahead and connect. So I'm going to go ahead and try to restart the server over. So I'm going to see if we can get Hyperlands on here. I'm really hoping that we can go ahead and do so because this is the direct Hypixel copy and it's actually really good. So let's go ahead and see if it actually connects. So when you guys get on the app, go ahead and type in play.brlns.net or any other server that you guys want to go ahead and connect to. You can keep the port the same. If you don't click on port, it's just going to default to 19132, but I decided to go ahead and put it in. So let's go ahead and click on stop. And then we're going to go ahead and start the server, and then let's go ahead and head over to our Xbox. When you guys are on your Xbox, go ahead and click on play. Then you want to go ahead and go all the way down and you're going to see Broken Lens or whatever server that you decided to go ahead and join. But Broken Lens is a sure connect because it's actually a decent server as you guys can see there. But we are having a lot of issues with Hyperlands for some weird reason. We just can't get it on Xbox. It keeps crashing and it's just not supported for some weird reason even though that it shows up. As you can see, we are on Broken Lens, which is actually a really good server, but it is a little bit laggy. Feel free to go ahead and play with both of these methods. I find the phone one to be convenient, and also the Xbox one to be convenient as well, because I have an Xbox, and I also do have an Android phone. But anyways, guys, that's going to pretty much wrap it up for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time on the next video on Shift Replays. Bye.